Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's been days and days and days since I came on here the last time, but who's checking? So I'm obviously home right at the moment. I'm definitely going to work tonight, but last night was kind of a rough night. And as a result of that, I felt like I've been sleeping all day. This morning when I got home, I got home sometime after 7, ate some breakfast, showered, and hit the hay. And I've been sleeping from, I'd say 8 o'clock till sometime after 3. So far, I've never slept for that long. Last night I had a one-to-one, -one, and honestly, I wouldn't choose that for myself. If I had a choice, I'd never choose that for myself. Because like I was saying on my Insta stories, I really thrive off of productivity, which means that... I like to be doing something the entire shift or have something that's going to take up the time, which means that, you know, by the time I'm done, the shift is also over. Sitting in one place the entire time just didn't really do it for me. Um, on the back end, I'm kind of doing my own little research here and there to kind of see the direction that I want to take next in my life. Not that this is not great, this is, but I'm also that person who's always looking for the next best thing. That does not at all mean that I don't enjoy whatever the thing is that I'm in right now, but I'm always looking for the next best thing that gives me an easier life or um, a more comfortable life, if you will. So while I'm on the quest of looking for the next best thing, I'm doing some back end research because it's one thing about me. Before I dive nose deep into something, I like to do my research. So I don't have any regrets when I start something. So that's where we're at, but Amia, um, last night too, the one-to-one -one was so very sad because they said that when she came in in the afternoon, like she was great and everything, and you can tell that her condition was just declining as the night progressed. Like this morning, before I left, it just felt like she was on her literal last leg. When I just went, she was responsive, like if you call her name, she's like moving her eyes and like her head to let you know that she's hearing you or whatever, and then... Um, closer to 7 a.m. None of that was happening. So it was really, really sad to watch. <clears throat> and honestly, in that moment, I was a bit selfish in terms of like, I was really there thanking God for just good health, you know, for um, not having any health struggles at the moment, nothing that puts me in the hospital and keeps me there or just puts me there in general, you know, but like just being so grateful um, all while being so selfish for good health. Um, so yeah, there was that. But it was a very sad night. I was so cold. Felt like I was full. I wanted to sleep. I slept on my break, which I don't normally do. It's very rare when I do. Because I do sleep in the day. But, um, yeah. Which, in essence, if I don't sleep in the day, I would probably still be fine. No, that's not productive. Anyways... Then I just woke up, I showered again, I went and cleaned the bathroom because I went in there and I just did not like how the bathroom looked. But um, yeah, cleaned the bathroom and now I'm just chilling on the couch. I'm going to watch some videos, tie my hair down so that later it could be nice and neat. And um, yeah, that's really the only plan for the day. There's food in the fridge because yesterday I made some brown stew, chicken, and some rice. So yeah. I put some peppermint oil in my hair to like all my scalp and it feels so minty. I'll see you guys later. I haven't vlogged in days because like I feel like it's just repetitive. Like the same thing is going on. I come home, I sleep, but I wake up at night, I go to work. The cycle repeats itself, you know? So now they're going to be like a, a lot more far and few in between. Unless of course there's something else happening that's like worthy of like picking y'all up. But for the most part... Life is a little bit repetitive right now, so I'm um, later. My hair is looking hella wild, I look hella sweaty. Oh my gosh, I have quite a few pimples, but I feel so much better about tonight, specifically because tonight I'm on the floor and not on a one-to-one. -one. I feel like I was very productive. I feel like I had something doing the whole time. I don't even feel tired on my break. Jules and I went to Dunkin' we had a slice of pizza and matcha, a good night. My head slightly hurts. Just drink some water for the first all night, but a good night. This is the first I've come home 
and not felt like sleep was absolutely killing me. And I think it might have something to do with the two cups of matcha that I had. This morning when Jules and I had break, we had the same break, we bought matcha. And just now, my other friend and I had a cup of matcha. She insisted. And I didn't want to mention that I went and ate with Jules. So I took it. However, on top of the matcha just now, we also had like a little breakfast sandwich. Which everybody knows when I'm fed, I'm a better experience. So there's that. So right now I don't feel like I have to sleep. And I'm not mad because right now I feel like I want to sit up and then go to sleep later on in the day. So we're going to try that out and see how that works out. Ain't no guarantee that this is going to work. Or this is going to end well. I might crash at 11 o'clock. Right now it's 8.38. I might absolutely crash at 11 o'clock. Honestly, too, um, I've been wearing these thicker socks that I had initially bought to wear with my Dot Martens in the wintertime. I've been wearing these in my sneakers and I absolutely love them. Normally I'd wear the little ones down by my ankle, but one, I'm sick of those because the socks basically cuts off where like my anklet is and these joggers are like a little bit short so like when I'm in the hospital at nights my ankles are cold because as we know at hospitals are cold so it just doesn't work these longer ones they feel so much more comfortable in my shoes I don't know how to explain how much more comfortable they are and they're long enough where it covers my 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 ankle where the joggers cut off so a win-win if you ask me where did I put my ID just now? So, I'm going to make sure that I don't do anything that makes me feel sleepy because right now I'm not sleepy. And we're going to see how long I'm able to stay up for before my body crashes. It's crazy because as I'm seeing that, I feel like I'm getting there. <laughs> it's wild. Absolutely has to be my mind. I have a little pigtail. I also think I'm... I'm I need to fix that little pigtail too. So we're gonna do that today. Along with other things. But um, yeah, it was very riveting to me that I'm not like extremely tired. <laughs> 